make my mount, my template, where this radio is going to mount on. Never mind this hole, it's just a scrap I had lying around the shop. So I'm going to go ahead and cut this out and then I'll mount it from behind on that black acrylic and uh, cut it with that router to get the hole in the acrylic. Yep. Just make sure this guy centers, so we're just going to sit to it. It's nice and straight. Fill our guide holes for our bolt. screws down in there. They'll pull tight once you tighten everything together, but that'll give us a good mounting point for the, all the acrylic and stuff. So now we have our stereo mount made. This is going to sit in the dash. And here's our dash panel. Factory, haven't touched it yet really. So I'm going to go ahead and put this piece of wood in that's holding this all together. And we're going to start molding it in here. Go ahead and show you guys that silver sharpie. That's the outline. Cut that guy out and uh, slide this piece of wood in here after scuffing up the plastic. Now that our ring is installed that we made earlier, it's basically sitting here by CA glue. So it's ready to go over, sand these sharp edges, kind of round them over. And then uh, I'll start laying some Dura glass or Mar glass on there. Vale. Just want to make sure you get a little V in between where the parts are made. Gonna meet right here. That way, you can go ahead and put that mar glass in there and fill it up, kind of like when you're welding. You want to fill it in with metal, but you want to fill it in with mar glass. It's really important. Don't leave it flush. That way, it's gonna crack later. Stuff on there. Always put your top pad back on. That's uh, my little pet peeve because if you're. Uh, shredding stuff off of here or sanding it and you go to blow it stuff falls in there now you go to spread it and now you can leave marks on your stuff cost you basically taint the whole can this guy i like to use the white hardener it doesn't have to be exact that's about right right there we don't got all day to wait for the stuff to go we're not doing body work in the car so let's go ahead and mix that up really good make sure you scrape the bottom so it gets everything thoroughly Basically, just want to get the stuff off the plate. It's a big mixture, a little more than what we needed, but just want to make sure we get this done. You want to kind of push it down in your holes.
up before it dries with the razor blade. Now we're going to uh, apply the Z grip because we have the mark glass done, ground down. Go up and pour a little bit of plastic honey in there. I've had this can for a while, they don't normally look like this, but this will just thin it out, get rid of some of the air bubbles. Because we don't need to go that thick on this stuff right here. So and uh, hardener, it's a catalyst, that's what's going to generate the heat and cause a chemical reaction to harden the bondo itself. So I'm going to start stuff on there. Now we got a little bit of the primer done. I'm gonna go ahead and put some texture on this thing. We're gonna use this stone paint. I know it sounds funny, but we're just gonna do a little bit of texture and then we'll knock it down when we're done. Just kind of keep your distance away from it. Get a nice heavy texture on there. Here's the texture up close. You can check it out yourself. Kind of gives it that nice rugged look like the rest of the van. But this is what it looks like. It's a little dusty, we'll just blow it off. Okay, so we got the plate mounted that we made earlier. These are lights, SMD LEDs. And we went ahead and covered them with silicone so that way they don't come out, kind of glue them down. And then we'll cover them with carpet so that way they don't shoot light from the backside and you see like on the crack on your dash and all that light. Okay, so we got this thing finished up here for the radio mount. Phantom mounting, LED backlit. Aluminum mounted on black acrylic. Looks pretty cool. Doesn't do justice on the uh, camera itself, but at least you can check it out. So soon we'll have this thing fired up. If you see us cruising around, you can check it out. We'll be at cruise night, stuff like that, shows, but there it is. That was today's project. One day. Fire!